try to recall the main features of the quantum mechanical model of the atom. The probability of finding an electron in an atom is given by a wave equation. The graph of this equation is an atomic orbital or electron cloud with a characteristic size, shape, and orientation in space. For hydrogen, the atomic orbital is spherical. Most of the time, the electron of hydrogen is found within this sphere with a one angstrom radius. Roughly, we might think of the orbital of hydrogen, called an S orbital, as corresponding to the Bohr orbital N equals 1. Since N equals 1, the orbital is called the 1s orbital. The 1s orbital and all other s orbitals are spherically symmetrical around the nucleus. A 2s orbital is spherical. Since n equals 2, it has a radius greater than that of the 1s orbital. For higher values of n, 3s, 4s, 5s and other such orbitals exist. Other types of orbitals with more complex shapes are found for n is greater than 1. A p orbital is dumbbell shaped, with its center at the nucleus. The dumbbell consists of two lobes 180 degrees with respect to each other. There are three types of p orbitals, with the same size and shape, but different orientations. They lie along the x, y, and z axis of the Cartesian coordinate system, and are designated the PX, PY, and PZ orbitals. There are five types of D orbitals and seven types of F orbitals. We will not go into a detailed description of their size, shape, and orientation, as these are quite complex. But, we'll take a look at the energies of these orbitals after we return from this break. <laughs>